Buongiorno. Buongiorno. So, a couple things. We have been MIA for a few days just because we've been wrapping up last minute projects and just, there's not really been a whole lot that we've done that's been hey, exciting. You signed all your book points? I did. I, 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 <laughs> trust me when I tell you that it was, it was amazing because I signed so many of them. I think, I don't even know how many. But with each one that I was signing, I kept thinking to myself, this person believes in me. Like, this person's amazing. Like, I kept thinking about you guys in each one I signed. And it was amazing. So, I appreciate you guys signing up for it. And, um... Can't wait to see and meet a lot I know. Of I've been already seeing so many of you posting pictures of the book. You've received the book. And I've gotten some questions about how are well, you receiving the book. And I'm not. Some people are receiving it earlier than others. It really depends. Like, different uh, manufacturers, I guess. The different, different, um... Retailers. Different retailers will ship a few days earlier or a few days later than the actual release date. But the release date is October 6th and we're going to have a huge party. We're going to meet a lot of you and I'm so excited. I've never done a thing like this before so it's going to be amazing. And then also what I wanted to update you on is that the hurricane, because I've gotten a lot of questions on Twitter and stuff about whether or not we've gotten affected by the hurricane. Luckily, it's just been raining here for about four days straight. Yeah, totally unrelated though. Little, it's unrelated, but it's literally been raining every single moment of every day for the past four days. Um, but luckily, it's missed us. So we are, we do keep all of those that were affected by the hurricane in our thoughts and prayers, of course, and keep, you know, say a little extra prayer for them as well and also mother nature i would really like for you to get your life together because i don't understand how you gave me winter and no fall you'll get fall next week <laughs> you'll get it next week because it went from 90 degrees to oh i don't know 39 40 however what what it was it last night it was like 40 degrees and we had to turn our heaters on so that it that did give me i'm not gonna lie and say i wasn't happy about it though I'm not gonna lie. I love it. I love it. So now I'm heading to uh, getting my hair done. I'm actually just gonna get color and style, like color. I'm gonna blow out today. I'm not gonna get a cut, but um, yeah, that's what's happening so far. Oh, Oktoberfest. That's today. And that's Oktoberfest. It's today. You guys know it's Joe's brother's annual October party, just to kind of kick off the fall season. So we have that to look forward to today, and um, seeing all the babies and the aunts, the uncles. It's a good day. All right, so if you guys watch the pumpkin pie ice cream, you know amazing. this is amazing. It is the bu but there's one thing more amazing in Lara's life right now. What? Mangoes. Listen, listen. I I'm not. I, I don't care that it's forty something degrees outside. I have been having a love affair with mangoes like you would not believe and I'm not going to be bound by a season because I'm going to continue to eat them as long as they are deliciously sweet and delightful and available in my grocery store. They are good, I gotta they say. They are really, I've been just having a complete love affair with mango. Mangoes and fish tacos. Man, oh. I never knew it was such a good combo. Yeah. I mean, I never really thought about it. So How have we not thought about it? One of the things I made... One of the things I make is my mango salsa, and we eat it with shrimp. Yeah, but that ain't fish tilapia. tacos. That ain't fish tacos. I did, I did do my jerk shrimp taco with a mango salsa, and you love that. You should put on a square tor tortilla. Well, that. They do make it cool. So check this out. These are ice, mini ice cream sandwiches with pumpkin pie ice cream, little ginger snap cookies, and because they were one? sold out of ginger snap, uh, I only got one box of ginger snap today. Actually, I got two boxes of ginger snap. And yesterday I got um, apple spice. Cookies, apple spice. So it's going to be a good combo because I made both. And there's a ticking sound in here. What's going on? I'm toasting some toast from avocado toast for lunch. Oh, oh. Well, how about what did you? Whoa. What did you have for lunch? Yeah, what did you guys have for lunch? Today is uh, Saturday. Rainy, cloudy, windy. You know, the usual. We're well, having a small lunch because we're going to go to. Uh, oh, yeah, we're going to Oktoberfest October in like Fest. five minutes. So there's really no need for. A big like lunch. Five minutes in like an hour and a half. Well, that's kind of like There's going to be a lot of eating. It's like an all day thing. And look at this. We're almost there. Try to get us to 2 million before Tuesday. That would be awesome. I know. I tweeted about that. That would be so cool. Wouldn't that be so cool? So if you make this ice cream, as I mentioned in the end of the video, serve this with ginger snaps because it's amazing. Take it one step further and make little mini ice cream sandwiches. And I'm telling you, people are going to love them. Mm -hmm. I just, I, they will. Just trust me.
here. Like, it's cool. It is, isn't it? It's the fall. Look how pretty she looks today, by the way. You always like it when I deep part my I just love you. Thank you. You love me too. So we're going to Starbucks. Starbucan. This is Rowan's campus here. So anybody who goes to Rowan, so nice. shout out to you. It's a nice so school. Nice. Yeah, it's so nice. So different than it used to be. A lot of new stuff. This whole area is under development. It almost feels like Thanksgiving because it is cold. We are going to get a fall at some point soon from what I hear. But it feels like Thanksgiving it time. It does. It's cold and the leaves are definitely turning. And not these trees though. These are making a liar out of me. Yeah, they are. <laughs> My lemon tree turned yellow. I gotta get into the greenhouses. Um, yeah, I hope it's not too late. Now, let's oh, see. and Patrick Starr gave me a shout out. Patrick Starr? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I died. I love Patrick Starr. That's really cool. This is actually a really great book. Um, it's, not a, it's not a recipe book, but it's it's the illustrated cookbooks of ingredients. Basically, it just tells you about, like, let me show you. That's cool. Look at all these different things. Everyone should have this book. But, like I said, don't buy it expecting it to be a cookbook but you see it tells you about every herb it tells you i mean it's just really really a cool book in the back there's a bunch of different eggs you know my dad used to eat my goose eggs did he really mm -hmm. see like like a bunch of different soy sauces and it's just a really cool like a bunch of different vinegars really cool. olive oils no that's still vinegars like different pasta shapes i think i might actually get this that's a very cool book. It's a really, really see, it tells you all about different fruit. And, and, and a really cool thing about this, I've seen this book before, that's why I wanted to get it. It's, it's got a lot of ingredients that you just don't, you don't, you might not see, you know, every day in a regular grocery store. Like, look at this cool. And they have the personal size watermelon in there. It's just cool. It's just a really cool, like, look at this finger line. Hey, Salvatore Jr. Oh. Talk to me like that. That's what, well, you know, that's uh, kind of what you are. You're... What was that song? Which one? I can't think of it. I can't think of it. I'm trying to get a, my uh, email to load, and it's not loading. Hey. It's really hard to find a book stand. You'd think that you could find a book stand in pretty much any store. What? How many places have we gone? Three Mostly stores. gone three stores so far. All of what you would think would have it. I think I'm just going to go on Amazon. Yeah. And uh, I don't. I guess that's the place to look because we tried TJ Maxx, Target, lights are on Barnes fire. and Noble. Barnes and Noble, you think would have had it? No, they didn't. It's crazy. Have it. I would have thought that would have been a real common thing. I see them in everybody's kitchen. So time to get them. The lies. It's a bookstore. How can I stand my book from a bookstore? They did have a great Starbucks in there. Yes, they did. We should go back all the time. Wonderful. It's really nice. It's a nice wow. hangout spot. It's right down the street. It was a, it's a good wonderful. Place. I mean, I never saw a Starbucks like it before in my life. And they had everything. There's the display, you know, their case. Is that what it's called? Mm -hmm. I mean, it was like six times the size of a normal one. I thought that was a snake. It's just a wire. It's Relax. just a wire. It's okay. I was looking all over for that wire. Now it has. Grilled stone fruit might sound crazy. Might sound crazy, but it's not crazy. It's very good. So good. And the smell in here, it's just the, this. And this is, there's, you can see this a little bit too uh, caramelized there, but the Looks smell, no, not too caramelized, but you know what I'm saying. The, um, the smell in here is phenomenal. I uh, love this, especially with like ice cream. Mm -hmm. I think that was, I'm going to do a drizzle of yogurt on top. Did we do this with ice cream before a long time ago? Was yeah. that pineapple? Uh, it's a different variation, but yeah, we've done that too. Mm. Mm. We've done a lot here. Oh, it's hot though. Woo! What smells so good? We got... Bringing a Thai... Green veggie curry. Thai green veggie curry. This was a recent episode on Laura yeah, in the Kitchen. Yeah, this is just a quick little 15 minute version. Mm. Not authentic, I know, but it is really good. And you look beautiful. Thank you. You look absolutely stunning. Coming Thank into this house every day and seeing you is the highlight. Thank you. Actually, I should say waking up in the morning is the highlight. a big pot of rice too. Love it. I gotta cut the grass. That can be our lunch for a couple of days. And then tomorrow, since we're gonna be gone, we can have lunch before we go. Tomorrow's the big day. I know. It's the big event. Pretty exciting, I have to say. I'm see. I got a text message from Amazon. Mine's on the way, and I, and I got. Oh, yours. I got to fill out the form so I can get a book plate. Oh. From this beautiful lady right here. Oh, thank you. I want to go get some mums and hay. Oh yes, the mission to find hay. And I was so happy to see Benji and the kids and Judy. They loved How your recipe. How cute are those girls? I sometimes I'm not gonna lie to you. I can't watch their vlogs because I'm like I watch those little girls and I'm like I can't. Like I feel like they should be living next door. So They're I really feel sweet. like. Oh, like you know, we should do. We should torture. plan a trip to Seattle. We should. It's like torture watching them, and they're so far away. 
And the way Juliana speaks, I don't know what it is. I love he it said something. So he says something. It's the bomb diggity or something, and she just says, "You can't say that." Yep. Something like that. She's so cute. Little pigtails. Oh, adorable. Such cuties, and they're all so well behaved. And I love the the way that Benji and Judy feed them, like real food, and they love it. I think that's so important. We are headed to pick up some fresh mums because I we had gotten some mums already for the front the, for our front porch, but because we had so much rain, they I don't know what happened to them. They did. They're not coming back. But right, this is our first place we can try. You wanna try here? I don't know. I don't really care for this place that much. Yeah, just give it a whirl anyway. No, I don't see anything. No. Okay. I'm just worried the places are gonna start closing. Yeah. Um. I want to get a couple bundles of hay. Is that the right word for it? Bundle? Um, I don't know. I guess it's a, a bale. Okay. Yeah, because it would be a bushel if it was tomatoes. It'd be a bundle if it was asparagus. Yeah, I guess so. And it would be a bale of hay. Do you like my funky sunglasses? I dig them. It's definitely fall. I'm gathering up some uh, mums and pumpkins, and we'll come back for hay because they don't have the large hay here. They ran out. Tomorrow. They'll have it tomorrow. Look at these. I'll have to come back on Wednesday then. These are all ready to explode. Yeah, I think I want these two. They're and nice and the big. two yellow ones right there, the smaller ones. Yeah, that would look really nice. Isn't that a thing? Yeah. yeah. Look at all these cool gourds. My Aunt Mimi would be so happy. I know. All different kinds of gourds. And all different sized pumpkins. There's some gourds I've never even known existed around here. Look at these crazy looking things. Some craziness right there, and a nice little grasshopper to go with it. Oh, hello, friends. Hi, friends. Look, Look at them having a nice little dinner there. Looking like a little bit of hay. This There's, is every time of year, man. They're loving life. Look how cute they are. So content. They really are. All right, here it is, guys. You know what this is, dear? It's an Instion hub. Wow. You it's really, so you did, uh, <laughs> You did good. So this is the new version that hooks up to Alexa. She didn't hear me, thankfully. So that we can control lights by talking to her without having to do some crazy rigmarole. So unfortunately, it replaces the one I already have. So I'll have to figure out a new home for it. Maybe I'll take it over the nursery or something. But um, yeah, that's what this is. So this is just some cords. This is the Insteon Hub with Amazon Echo technology. So, I don't know how people cook without aprons. I just can't do it. I try. I, really I don't know try. why you would do such a thing. I really try to cook without an apron on, but he went through that long card again. He put that apron on. First of all, it keeps my pants up because I'm not wearing a belt. Wouldn't be a Vitaly vlog if the memory card didn't get full. Yeah, right? No, I'm just saying, it holds my hands up. And um, I'm always touching my, like if I touch something in my, well, when I wash my hands, my hands are wet, I always do this because my hands are wet, you know? You broke my candle. I did. I knocked the wick in there. Let's get that fixed. Good luck with that. Let me see. You cut hmm. it in there. Oh, wow. I really did. You got to kind of cut around it with a knife or something. Well, here you go. Oh, I got to do it? You, you, you broke Actually, it. just no, give, me a, give me a blow torch. Uh, 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 uh. Here, I, I got I got, I got this. In the kitchen, because this is just all Just with free. that. No cutting. I'm just, I'm just, I got this. Let's see. It wasn't me anyway, it was the squirrels. They were hanging out. It was all you. It was, they were having a good fire, you know. All you. Here we go, hold on. If I get it to just go a tiny, it tiny bit. A little bit, then it goes off. Is that what happens? And just like that, I undefected it. I undefected it. You did? Everything's great. Whoa, that's some serious blur, there we go. It's all fixed up. Thank you. You owe me, big time. Dinner time, guys. Got I have some no idea what I'm wearing, by the way. Leftover chicken. I got Brie Brie. Yo, yo. I got some kale. And I got Brussels sprouts. And you guys are stuck in a car with me tomorrow, so. <laughs> it's gonna be terrible. Yeah. Gonna suck. No. Can you see everybody back there? We're having I'm a good trying, time. I'm trying to see Brie, but We're I can't. Here. There she is. We're headed to our party. Today, today is the official day of the book launch, which is so exciting. I've had, I don't even know how many people between Twitter and Instagram um, tag me in the photos of the book that you've received. So if you have received the cookbook, I hope that you're loving it as much as I am. And tag me, take a picture of yourself with the book, tag me on Twitter, let me see, you know, 
just share because it's really exciting. I've seen so many beautiful faces. It's amazing. So today we're headed to New York. We're gonna have a nice uh, launch party with a lot of you that are gonna be there. And then we're gonna be doing a live broadcasting from the party, a nice Q&A session. It's gonna be a lot of fun. There's gonna be food from the book at the party. It's gonna be a great time. And we're really locked out for the day too because it's a beautiful day. temperature but it's like 70 degrees 71 it's beautiful it is sunny and we've been having such horrible weather and that I just didn't realize I didn't think it was gonna turn out so well but it it's a very nice back massage Mikey keep it going for today's live event. You are officially invited to the Vitaly's book launch event. Um, we, I will say that I, I really wish you were all here. I do have an incredibly beautiful audience here, but we want to celebrate with you at home as well, which is why we are broadcasting right here from the YouTube space New York, who was gracious enough to host tonight's event. We're gonna be doing a Q&A today, answering a lot of your questions from home and some questions live, which I'm so nervous about, so be kind. Um, <laughs> I've got the ever so fabulous Michael Buckley here. Thank you for coming, my Hi. love. Hi, thank you. Thanks for having me. I'm so happy to have Congratulations. you. Congratulations, this is so beautiful. Thank you. So we were at an event in New York like yeah. a couple months ago talking about maybe this will happen and yes. here we are. So thank I you know. so much for having me. What do you think when you see this? What is your first thought? Oh my gosh, what do you think? I, th I just, like it's, it's honestly a little bit weird because I feel like that is such a great book, but wait a minute, that's me. <laughs> so it's like I did that. It, it feels incredible. Turnout, you guys. So nice to see all of you. There's Bree Bree. Checking in. <laughs> it's so nice to see all of you. They got the poster signed by so many of you. We're going to be bringing it home probably next Friday. We broke the record by how many people came to the event in the UT space in New York. We almost broke fire. We, we broke fire. Thoughts are hey, you know, a little exhausted, but well worth the trip. Well worth the time, and uh, I'm very proud of Marita for the work that she's done for this, and very proud of you, Jojo, for doing all the work that you've done as well. Uh, I will say that it was a very fun trip, and I enjoyed it, and um, hopefully there will be many more of these in the future. Back home, what a great time, guys. Uh, I feel like I'm on cloud nine. It's so bizarre because I can put your faces to your username and it's crazy and I loved it and I'm gonna do it again <laughs> and again and again, but no, I don't I know if I can do it again, but. Got mine in the mail today. So I that's, you know what that means? This is Joe's unboxing. Unboxing of mine. Oh. Came in the mail, just like a lot of you guys. We've been getting, I've been getting hundreds of emails, comments, questions, maybe thousands. The book plates have not been shipped yet. See, I not shipped mine. with the book. I filled out the form for the autograph book plate. I did not get mine yet. It does not come with the book. It ships separately. Typically, this can take months, but I don't think it's going to take months for Laura's. These get shipped from the from the publisher. I'm pretty sure it's going out like tomorrow. Mm -hmm. But don't mark my soon. word. It's soon. They're going out soon. Um, it's just shipping so separately. Don't panic if you get your book from from Amazon or Barnes and Noble or wherever you get it from, and it's not in there. A book plate is a full it's a label that's autographed by Laura, and they're we're not shipping them out here. The publisher's shipping them out. Is this too much chest? No, it's I not. Like you look chest. so, so shiny. It's been all chest today. We're both, you and I are both. But you know what this is? Aww. Now I still have the first copy. 
But that's the one that gets face framed. Face hurts with smiling so much. I have not felt like this since you and I first started dating. Because I made you smile so much? Yeah. Am I to tell you that? This is it, guys. This is my official copy. To my love. Nothing makes me happier than seeing that smile. And that is for you. Look, it's the same smile. So I'm really happy about so many people it loving it and all the it positive amazing. stuff that people Look, are saying. If you if you get your book, oh, real quick. Oh yes, if you get Look if you get it, how like, many people are taking. I mean, these are tags. We love you seeing guys these are. tags. Look how beautiful. Look how beautiful. I mean, it's just amazing. Some of the people we met tonight. Which was incredible. It was such an amazing event. It really was amazing. I'll put the link down below for this. the full blown, um, the, the full event so you can watch it. This is just the next, like, in the past, like, 10 hours. And then on Twitter, I think Twitter hates me because I keep tweeting, retweeting, and tweeting you guys. But they'll have to live with it. Well, it's important. I'm, you know, I wanted, I didn't want to vlog too much there because there's a lot of people in line. I didn't, yeah. and there were, we were taking a lot of pictures with people and I didn't want to be, to be rude. So I had just a couple clips in there. And I really and hope. You were happy with the broadcast. Yes. Oh, well, that's the other thing. So I was actually in the broadcast room, uh, commenting with you guys. Broadcast room there is a little bit more sophisticated than what we have here, <laughs> um, but it's pretty cool. And um, the only thing was there was that technical thing where Laura had like an earring clipping on her mic. But you really, if you watch it with headphones on, you hear it a lot more than if you're watching yeah. it with just regular computer speakers. So if you get the chance to watch it with computer speakers, eh, you won't hear it as much. Yeah. Off topic. Our couch and coffee table for the den comes in tomorrow. Oh, Finally. exciting. We'll have the, the house finished then at that point and I can go to sleep. No? We're still waiting for the floor to get redone. Oh, we're waiting for it? Does that mean Joe needs to go grab a hammer and a screwdriver and go do the floor? All right, guys. Thank you, guys. It is Give us some love. Thank you for everyone who tuned in. Thank you for making it incredible. And thank you for everyone incredible. who showed up and you making this incredible best. and making her dream come true. You guys are just the best. We love you guys. We love you. All right, guys, this is the historic piece of the Seven Mile Bridge that still stands here today. It was built between 1908 and 1912. It was known as the um, eighth wonder of the world. And 